Yo, what's going on guys? It's Chad's here. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're having a good day as always. Thank you so much for joining me in another Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus Eden run. But today the seed is going to be a 2923BJ. Hi, hi. 46. That again is 2923 Bravo Juliet 46. I'll pop the seed down just below so we've got it for the duration of the round. And let's get things started because, oh wow, look at the hairdo. Hairdo is sick. Hairdo is phenomenally sick right now. We ain't got a bomb. Please be a bomb. No. We don't have a bomb. I need to get that tinted rock. That is something I want to get. Because we do only have two red hearts and one soul heart. Which, in theory, should be enough. Should be ample. But. And we all know I like big butts and I cannot lie. 15 tier delay. 15 tier delay is awful. Awful! But we have curved dam curved horn, I think it is, which adds like a 2 or 3 damage buff. And it is insane. It is awesome right now. I would not have continued this seed if we did not have curved horn. Um, literally just turned on. First time in a week. And... Straight into Eden. That spider's going to get me. And this was the very, very first seed that we've tried. And as soon as I saw 6.2, I just went, right, let's record. <laughs> let's record, let's not even do a practice run. So we might be a little rusty, as always. But to be fair, our best gameplay is still a bit rusty, shall we say. And yeah, if if... If we can increase our tier delay, we're going to be absolutely laughing. Absolutely laughing. But again, one soul heart should be enough to see us through to the devil deal on the next floor if we play smart. Which we all know ain't going to happen because it's me. And um, we finally get a bomb. God damn. So obviously, Jar of Flies is our active item. So as you've seen, we've killed quite a few enemies. We've buffed up quite a few few flies so we've activated it oh double so oh, nice um activated it and been a melon and blew ourselves up <laughs> but uh, we activated it and that of course it gives us the flies which is huge and that's just gonna basically secure us throughout the boss no problem at all is that adrenaline yeah for every empty heart container you get damage up I don't have any empty heart containers, and it would mean losing both my soul hearts plus a red heart, which, of course, I'm not a massive fan of doing right now. So, we're going to go to the boss, and it's Famine with a new look horse. Obviously, we do still have Revelations installed. We are still playing on this, so there are going to be new mobs, new items, and... Um, of course, this section for new levels with a 15 tier delay, I, I just cannot justify doing the glacier. I really, really can't. But it is what it is. Right, basement two. Two soul hearts to secure the devil deal. We should be okay. But again, we just really need tears up at this point. We really, really do. We do have ball of bandages, which is an orbital that we got from famine. And is going to help us offensively defensive type, if that makes sense. <laughs> or oh, the mind, yes! You absolute legend. So the mind, as you can see now, we have the full mapping. Um, I will never pass up on the mind. Unless, of course, we're on a rerun and I've already got it, then there's just not much point to it. But, um, yeah, we'll absolutely keep the mind. So that's going to help us out massively. Unless, of course, we have Curse of the Lost. Oh, come on. I need this salt. Oh, no, I got a bomb. No. I'm going to have to activate the flies there. Mainly so I can just keep the devil deal. That is my main concern right now. So we'll do the boss now. Little Horn. All 15 flyers, please attack. Thank you. That is him nearly dead off of that. 
almost dead. Oh, wait, no, he is. <gasps> I get magic mush too. Oh my god. This is insane. Oh, a little area. Okay. A bit, a bit worthless. A bit worthless. We're not going to take him. Um, but we will clear these poops. I'm gutted that magic mush doesn't give us a tears up. Because it's pretty much an all stats up. Minus tears up. And I'm a bit like, mm -hmm. tears up would be so much better than range to have. But just a little bone of contention. Oh, we're getting keys for days, man. Keys for absolute days. Do I go. Yeah. Yeah, let's. Let's. Because again, I do really, really want to bomb. Oh, God, I, this was a bad room to come and do, weren't it? Ball of bandages playing bits there. Ooh -wee. Ooh -wee. <gasps> oh, you spider took an extra step. Spider Man got a bomb. Gonna use it on a rock. Get some hearts and then die. That is what I play it like. I'm sorry. To be honest, I would much rather get the soul heart from there than, a tinted, than get into the secret room. The secret room, as we've seen, can have an item like Transcendence in, which is like the hanging rope, the noose, which will give you flight. But, of course, normally if there is an item in there, chances are it's going to be a case where you need to blow up a rock to get to the middle platform. And we wouldn't have it anyway, so got Bumbo picking up our coins. He's getting bigger and bigger. That's not going to help me at all. Well, well, well. Do that, although we don't really need that. If we could get down to like one red heart left with two empty red heart containers and then an Abundance of soul hearts or demon hearts. We'd get them. We'd get what well, I think it would only work out like 0.4, so it's not much of a damage up, but it's the equivalent of like an actual damage up item. So that would be good to get. <coughs> Glycoma? No, canes of the right. Bounces around the room. We have had it on a previous run. Petrified poo, I would take. But not over Curved Horn. Because if we pick up Petrified Poo, our damage drops. Oh wow, it's still 7.39. I didn't even notice. <gasps> our actual damage is 10.39. Holy cow, Magic Mush, you're doing wonders. Yes, a double bomb, finally. I think Bumbo got that coin. That's fine. That's fine. He is very, very useful when he gets massive. Very, very useful. But it does mean that we're forfeiting a lot of, lot of coins for him. I'm half tempted to leave these spawning a little bit so that we can get some extra flies. We've got six. Make that seven, make that eight now, and make that nine. That'll be ten, eleven. As long as we can get in there with a healthy amount of flies, the boss is going to be a doddle. Yeah, we'll call it there, because that will give us fifteen. That's a perfect amount. And it's pestilence. So activate that, take all the flies out. And bang. Done. <laughs> no devil deal, but that's fine. Ball of bandages. I don't want to turn this into a shooting um, orbital. So I'm going to leave it. I'm going to go in the secret room, though. Oh, yes, we get a demon out. Legendary. Oh, I nearly took that then. Oh, wee. Oh, wee. 
Hi! I'm trying! <laughs> I wanna watch Rick and Morty again. Oh, wait! How will the season ever end now? Reroll all of my items, eh? Oh. If I didn't have the mind or magic mush, I would absolutely reroll this. But I don't know if it can be justified to do it. Because we're in. Yes, we do have bad tears at the moment. But we're in a very, very good spot. Damage wise, health wise, active item that does actually help us to a degree and can output a lot more damage for us but I, it's a tough one man it's tough because I, I don't want to lose the mind and magic mush but I'm, yeah I, I think I'm not even going to ponder it anymore you know, it, it, I think it would be wrong for us to re-roll this right now. I mean, if we got a really bad... If we got, like, say, Curse of the Unknown. Or Curse of the Blind, I should say. And it... We picked up, say... I don't know, Wizard's Hat or the Dunce Cap type thing. In here... Then, oh my god, Seraphim as well. Jeez, what a powerful ally. Definitely not re-rolling now. Um, then, yeah, I would absolutely re-roll. Because even with, with, these, with this build right now, having Dunce Cap is just awful. Because you'd shoot in like a V shape. And it just makes things ten times harder. Oh, 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 e, oh. No. Oh. Go, 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 die. Thank you. Oh my god, there's Ippocac flies. It's an Ippa fly. Ippa fly to the right guy. And we get the stain. Okay. Activate the flies. Forgot to do that. And boop. Done. No, we sh Oh my god, we get PJs. Holy cow. Okay. Nothing, really. Delirious. Don't want that. Breath of Life, definitely don't want that. Um, scapula, it means I'll have to lose all of my health and get down to half a heart. And Lazarus's Rags is probably the best thing that we can have. It gives us, enables us to have an extra life. Um, so I will take that, but jeez. This is a, turning out to be quite a run. Mid-game, this is picking up. This is picking up. Really, really picking up. Seraphim is great. Because it does deal 10 damage. It, it's basically matching our damage per tier. And it has home in tiers. It is, it's a monster. It's an angelic monster. <gasps> yeah, not good with two of them in this room. Never have been. Don't think I ever will be. Greed head. Done. Umbilical cord. Down to half a heart. Get a little Steven. <laughs> oh, Cubone. I didn't realise what it was. Cubone. Right. We might... Holy water? Not... <sighs> Getting a lot of holy items, aren't we? I am actually going to spawn the beggar there and then blow it up. Our angel deal is through the roof right now. Absolutely through the roof. Hive mind? I... Hopefully we get a coin because I would actually quite like that right now. Because of our active item, we... Hive Mind is one of the best things we can have right now. Please have a bombing. Please have a bombing. No. No. Been item room. Been to the store. 
Let's go to the boss. To the boss. Nice. Oh no, not adversary. Oh no. This is my most feared boss. Like, I, I'm, I don't wor ever worry about facing Delirium or Hush. Mainly because I know that I'm going to get hit from it and probably die. But this adversary, I always think I'm going to lose so much health to it because of its home in... Relative home in Brimshot. Brimshot? Brimstone. But I prefer Brimshot, actually. And I can never, ever play it. Oh. I forgot to activate my flies as well. Hive Mind, as you can see, has doubled the size of the flies and its damage. And there we go. Poor adversary done. We done all right. We only took one hit from it. Or two. I think. <laughs> it was not bad at all. But a couple of monster. I really thought the flies had killed it then. I so thought the flies had killed it. So I ran in. We'll get ball of bandages doing a bit of damage there as well. Stem cell heals half a heart upon travelling to the next floor. That is useless. To be fair, the only trinket that we could possibly want is cancer. Because that's like a minus four tier delay or something. Huge. So, oh, sissy! Hello! With hive mind? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a in heart dog. Coming up. Charge me. Charge me. Go on. I dare you. Dare you. Can't. You're like a neutron. Ha! <laughs> Why the hell did I go down that route for the joke? <laughs> that was just weird. Refresh stock is not bad. We don't really have the coins and this is the last floor with a shop in, so... Oh, there's Black Candle. That's huge. We need to go and find five more coins. Just five. That's all. Just five. Oh, I can't move. Skull on the floor. Can't move. Skull. I need five coins that I can get to before Bumbo does. <gasps> Coin. <laughs> And nope. Okay, okay, okay. Let's all calm down with your brim shots. Uh, I don't really want to use my only bomb on that. <gasps> Coin, yes. Three more. Three more coins. <gasps> no, you just took a fiver, you prick. You prickly bush. Ah, oh, damn it. Coin, mine. I need two more. I need two more. Uh, no, because there's spikes there, and if I try and rush, I'm just going to end up losing another heart. I'm, I think I'm just going to have to try and clear some rooms. <gasps> coin, 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 coin. Mm, Bumbo! Stop! It's getting dangerous because I'm rushing Bumbo, and as soon as I see a coin, he goes for it as well. And then I end up getting hit by the enemies, and it sucks. Could go in the curse room. Not really a massive fan of going in there right now. I might open. Oh, for God's sake. Took more damage. I'm going to open that. Because there's a coin. Oh, a I, need, I need one more. One more. One more. 
one is better. It's kind of... No, no, you don't push the bomb back. Thank you kindly. Wow. I need one more coin. I should get it. I've, I've got a couple of rooms left, so... You know, you shouldn't have... Oh, come on, that's not fair. And what's less fair is that Bumbo can travel over thing. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. The reason why I'm fighting for black for these coins for Black Candle so much, if you don't know, Black Candle gives you curse immunity, so you never, oh, you never get another curse for the run, and. Um, it increases your Devil Deal chance like that. It gave us an extra 7.5%. Plus, it gives you a Demon Heart as well. It is phenomenal. I am phenomenal, phenomenal. To a spade, duplicate the keys. Sure, why not? Because I'll need them for the chest if we're lucky enough to get down there. Balls of Steel Pill. That was very lucky. Gives us two extra soul hearts. Activate the flies here. Bang! Done. Nice. <laughs> right, what's in boss rush room? Lucky foot and blood right. No other items. So let's get out of here. Oh, wow. I was lucky that was. <clears throat> right, boss is down, down, left, 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 up. We should get a lot of flies in our jar from this floor. Oh no. Oh no. Keep. On a um, Red Dead stint at the moment. I've got the want to just be playing it. I've gone through a bit of a f phase this week. So... We obviously last week we were playing a lot of Mario, and this week I've been trying to set aside just a single hour a day, mainly in the evening because of you know the day job getting in the way. And oh, that's mine, it's mine with the luck up. Oh, we broke free just as he died, poor soul. Um, yeah, in the evening because the day job, and then. I've been playing, I think Monday was a bit of Mario Kart, um, finishing off trying to get some of the Grand Prix done. Um, we've done all of them on 50, all of them on 100, we've got all of all gold on 150, but there's a couple of the gold ones that are like, I think one of them I've got no stars on, one of them I've got one star on. And a couple of them I've got two stars on. Because I didn't get the full 60 points. And so I've been trying to go back through and get all gold three stars. And, um... Yeah, so we're doing that on Monday. Oh, yes! Oh, no, that's two runes, though, isn't it? No, we don't want that. We wanted two trinkets. Um... So, yeah, we've been doing that. Then, Tuesday and Wednesday... Um, spent an hour in Red Dead Redemption on PC, just playing through with little Smokey, the horse, which um, I need to do an update on Instagram about that, actually, because <laughs> we're posting a, a few bits on there. I hate that eye. I hate it. Because, um, obviously, I've been trying to post a lot more on social media, and Instagram's the only place that I use you know, if if I'm using a social media, it's Instagram. And it's it was a case of where I was just trying to get like some nice little shots of little Smokey and just show him off a little bit. Like, hey, look at him. He's it, it was adorable. Wait. Don't read into that sentence too much. But no, it's true. He was he was adorable. He was he was a beautiful horse. Beautiful horse. And, um, yeah, he's, um, we went off bounty hunting one evening, 
And um, unfortunately, the bounty hunters found me as well. So he um, unfortunately took a quite a few. I will say he took about seven double barrel shotgun shots to the face. Uh, um, and then I received the same fate, unfortunately. And um, we've now got a new horse called Ghost. I'll um I'll have probably put something on Insta about about him. Um or at least like showing him off. Oh, that was my only bomb, you absolute moron, Brad. Um probably put a little bit of a story Instagram on him. Um just so you can see him. So I've been doing that obviously on Tuesday, Wednesday. And Thursday was what was Thursday? Thursday, I don't think I did anything. I think I literally finished work and just crashed out. I think I just absolutely monged out on Thursday. Because every night, been what been what's how my schedule has gone now since I've gone back to work has been get up, go work, finish the moment I finish immediately start editing the next day's video then do the thumbnail then do um, the next day's thumbnail then do edit again then upload then obviously do the SEO the tags blah 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 and that's all it is I don't know how I was doing it before <laughs> before because obviously I had like I had like five weeks where I'd done nothing absolutely nothing um, because of my knee, and I literally, I only managed to record probably four videos throughout those six, well, five, six weeks. I'm going to die here. I am actually going to die here. Um, so yeah, it's been, I honestly don't know how I was doing it. I'm so tired and exhausted. Bumba, you need to... There you go, you're beefed up now a bit, aren't you? Oh, this is going to be tight, man. Um, so yeah, literally, I've been trying to set aside an hour so I can just purely relax. Unwind from the day. And try and get some rest in. <laughs> and yeah. It's, um... Like I say, I, I, I do not know how on earth I was doing it before. I really, really don't. But, that being said, um, like I said, I've been setting an hour aside of an evening to just game. But even then, <clears throat> I'm trying to get <clears throat> like some behind-the-scenes shots or some like game I'm currently playing type shots for Instagram, be a bit more social and... Just offer a little bit more, really, to be honest. And so, yeah, it's just been work, 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 work. Which has been fun. I've really enjoyed get, getting back into... Oh, God, it respawned you with one heart. Jeez. Um, really enjoyed getting back into the recording and editing. Now I can actually properly sit. <laughs> which sounds stupid, I know. But my damn is so frustrating not being able to sit and just game. Which is why the Switch has helped so much, which is why I've been playing so much Mario. And yeah, it's been a lot of fun. So, I can't believe we managed to get through that no hit. I cannot believe it. <laughs> I really can't. Please have some good items here. Absolutely none. Absolutely none. Okay. Hopefully we get a boards of steel pill out of this. What's this? Pheromones. No. Pretty fly. No. Okay. Pestilence, you've got to go, my friend. War, you've got to go, my friend. Is this my creep? It is, isn't it?
But yeah, so we've been doing that, and um, yesterday, on Friday, we... Um, <gasps> this is a bad room. It's actually not a... It's not a terrible room, but it's bad. Oh my god, a lot of projectiles. But Bumbo, as you can see, now chasing. Oh, we get a magnet. I don't want a magnet. Um, yeah, we reinstalled Borderlands 3. And you might... If you've been watching these videos, you're probably thinking, what the hell? You've... Cardboard robot. When used, gives the player a cardboard robot suit for a short time. Player fires a large amount of short-range lasers. The suit absorbs damage, damage, but decreases the amount of time in the suit. Clearing rooms increases the amount of time in the suit. I kind of want to try this. Okay. Okay, this is strange. This is one of the new items. Well, I say new items. It's one of the items from the Revelations mod. Um, you can see the timer in the left going down just underneath the heart. I'll take the poison bombs. Why not? Yeah. Then the suit goes. Oh, it does actually explode. Okay, that's good to know. That is very, very good to know. Um, but yeah, you might be thinking, what the hell? You've not long just reinstalled Fallout 4. You've not long reinstalled Fallout New Vegas. You've not long started Red Dead Redemption again. Like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> I'm one of those people. I start playing a game. I get mo partly through it. And I'm like, I kind of fancy playing this, actually. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. That is a solid seed. If you don't play like I did, you can easily win that. Easily, easily win that. Using the flies a lot more let let me down. But um, yeah, you can easily, easily win that. I would highly recommend that seed. That is a lot of fun seed. Very, very fun. Um, but yeah, I get part way through a game and I'm like, oh, I kind of fancy what playing this actually. So I play that and then I flick between all of them at once. And it never used to be like that. It used to just be solidly I'd play COD. Then I'd solidly play like Horizon. Then I'd finish that. I'd go back through and get some achievements or trophies. Then I'd go back into Fallout. I'd play right through that again. Then I'd go back and play like, say, GTA. I'd go back through and complete the campaign on there, get the trophies that were missing. Then I'd go back to COD or something like that. But now, since I've been doing YouTube and it's been very much a variety, it, I'm all over the place. I'm absolutely all over the place. Because, I mean, like, if we go... I and mean, what I'm going to do is... Um, do, 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 do. My... The current games I have listed... Um, Black Ops Cold War, Fallout New Vegas, Fallout 4, Overwatch, Halo, Master Chief Collection, uh, Spyro, GTA 5, Binding of Isaac, Skyrim, Borderlands 3, Stardew Valley, Outer Worlds, and Red Dead Redemption 2. On, on this PC. And I'm literally flicking through all of them. Spyro will always stay installed because I freaking adore Spyro. It is my all-time favourite game. Um, I that I would never get rid of that. <laughs> I'm actually debating with myself at the moment to get it for the Switch so I can play through it all again. Um, I still need to play the third one for for here, but uh, yeah. That is the current state of my games, which I'm playing through all of them at once. Literally, since I've done YouTube, I've done a bit of a game, 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 a bit of a game. Because I never wanted the channel to be one game and that's it. Then move on, do the next game. But no, I am going to call it a day because I am waffling. Very, very much so. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for joining. If this sort of content is for you, please let me know. Drop a comment, drop a like, smash that subscribe button. It would genuinely mean the world to have you here. Really, really, really would. Um, 
it has just started absolutely hammering down. Oh god. We're in for a storm. Um, so yes, like, like I said, I'm going to call it a day. Um, that seed today, the 2923BJ46, was such a good seed. Played carefully, you'd be absolutely fine. I took a lot of damage around... I th it was when we got to It Lives Floor. Those big chunky eyes, I always take damage on. Always, always, unless I've got Flight, Spectral Tears, or Brimstone, or something like that. I will always take damage. So we took a lot of damage on that floor, which didn't help. And then we respawned as Lazarus earlier than I was anticipating, I'll be honest. But that is an amazing seed that, you know, could easily be done. So, no worries. No worries. Well, yes, I shall disappear now. Because no one's probably listening at this point. So, no, thank you so much for joining. Going to call it a day. It's going to be strands out. So take care. Stay safe. Stay awesome. But most importantly, have fun. All right, guys. Take care. Bye.